Welcome. Thank you for joining us on the empty side of the table. This is going to be an unboxing of the game Carnival of Monsters by Richard Garfield. <clears throat> the Royal Monstrological Society counts among its members the most renowned and respected experts in monster lore throughout the entire empire. Each year, the society permits only a single new member to join, so applicants compete to prove their worth with the most magnificent menagerie of monstrous beasts they can find and capture. To aid in these quests of discovery, the society grants Hello Basil, every aspiring monster monsterologist, a small stipend which they can use to hire additional experts and fund their journeys to the magical lands where the most exotic beasts reside. After four seasons of hunting, would-be members present their collections at the organization's annual banquet, an event known as the Carnival of Monsters. So it says here, Carnival of Monsters is a card drafting game in which players collect sets of land cards that allow them to capture and display strange and exotic monsters, hire talented staff to help them run their enterprises and pursue their own secret goals, players earn points for returning safely with monsters completing their secret goals and earning gold crowns. In the end, the player with the most profitable and spectacular carnival is the winner and is installed in the monster in the society's <laughs> and is installed as the society's newest member. Sorry, we got a bit distracted. Lots of artists in this too. Alright, let's take a look. Lots of artists contributing to the game. Sorry it took us so long to do this. We just uh, had the beginnings of what they're calling a bomb cyclone last night here in the uh, Bay Area, California. And it's calmed down right now, but it will ramp back up again on Saturday, I believe. So initially what attracted me to this was the art. Okay, let's see what we have here. Instruction book. Let's see. As I'm pretty sure I mentioned in a previous video, we had been gifted the um, entire first season Kickstarter uh, thing of Final Girl, the game. So if and when that comes in, we'll be doing an unboxing of that. Hello, Basil. I thought so. Okay, yeah. Richard Garfield, the uh, gent behind Magic the Gathering. <clears throat> okay. So these look like they are player boards. Yeah. Wow, never seen them uh, done like this before. Cool. Extra bags to hold the chits. Got dice here. Well, I should probably open these up. Take a look at them. I'm not quite sure how these are uh, used. Is there's not... Uh, doesn't sound like there's combat in this game, which I'm fine with. These are obviously six-sided. We've got two of the same symbol here, one of this one, and the rest are all blank. 
look like cages, so I'm guessing that's how you capture the monsters. Sorry about that. And those are uh, wooden dice. Hello, Basil. Got a nice big thick sheet of score cards. Double sided also, if that matters. Hey, look out, buddy. Come here. Now, here is what I'm most interested in on the cards. There's quite a few of them too. So it looks like these are the monsters and it looks like these are the land cards. Oh, come on. Yeah. <clears throat> Wanna play with the plastic, Basil? No? All right. So we've got Griffin. Cooks a cuttle, a wormling. Oh, that's cool. There's actually um, some different variations with each one. Carnivorous fungus, basilisk, bat wolf, a pair of those. Nice. Mud spider, great worm, cave crawl. Two different ones of those. The Unnameable and a Magma Beast. Ghoul. So I'm guessing that uh, these symbols here and possibly the color of the cards, oh, there's several ghouls, are going to determine um, what lands you place them in or you find them in. Shadow Cat. Hey, buddy. Night Troll. Shade, two shades, Whisperer, and a Dibic. <clears throat> Dibics are those demons that people find in boxes, yeah? Or imprison them in. Great Fire Spider. Nephilim, Nosferatu, Screecher, and a Succubus. Hmm, Nightmare, I like that. Dreamcatcher, Moon Beast, uh, Outer Realm Spider. Hello, Basil. Hey, Pazuzu, Ancient Enemy. Okay, now it looks like we've got the hunters here, or your assistants. What do we got? We got Katie Aronax and Johan Lindenbrock, Robin Goodall, Amelia Frog, John Michael Dyer. Henry W. Remington, uh, Michonne N. Frazier, Isaac Van Horn, P.T. Martin. This uh, dude looks a bit different, so I don't know if they're... They're explorers. Okay, intrepid explorers. Mungo Boyle, Roald Starbuck, Lara Oatley, Selma Cardenas, Kind of a gazette. Not quite sure what these are used for. Um, press preview, public authority. Essentially all the same except for the title and uh, little picture in the paper there. We'll just breeze through these. Hey, what's going on, Vessel? <laughs> <clears throat> authority on subterranean creatures, authority on supernatural creatures, stratospheric creatures, sinister creatures, sylvan creatures, submarine creatures, the gates of sleep, seeker beyond the gates of sleep, the big game hunter, second row is good enough for me, enthusiast of little things. Okay, so these are uh, maybe um, secret objective cards. And those are all pretty much the same there. Darkland Season, Enchanted Forest Season, Airy Season, Depth Season. Okay, these are obviously season cards and there's a different uh, land type for each one maybe. 
These are the loans that you can take out in order to fund your uh, projects. I'm not quite sure how these work, but I'm, I've heard that you will need to take out loans quite often because money goes rather quickly in this game. What's this? Hmm. Oh, looks like something was torn from the side there. All right, no big deal. Just part of the insert. These look to be the land cards, and possibly more of some of the other cards. What do we have? We have the depths. Those look the same. Okay, yeah. Lots of depths cards. Those are all the same. Um, although this one is a depth, so it says chasm on it. This is a mer castle. Enchanted forest. Those are the same. Yeah. Enchanted forest forgotten temple. That's pretty. Fay Nexus. And Forefather of Life. It's like an ant. Airy. So a lot of these are going to be the same, yeah? Let's see. Fiery Mountain. Stairway to the Gods. Cloud Castle. Caves. Just watched a movie about caves. Or a cave, what was it? It wasn't the descent, but there's people there. No, they're underwater. They're in underwater caves. And um, they meet like these bat like creatures. Caves, Great Cavern. Sorry, I can't remember the name of the movie. Mushroom Labyrinth, Fountain of Embers. Darklands. These. So a lot of those are going to be the same until we get to those special areas, I guess. Here we go. Stronghold of the Doomed. I like that. <clears throat> Maya of Deaths. Death. I'm sorry. Maya of Death. Gates. Gates to the Abyss. Dreamlands. And these are going to be the same. Let's see here. Right? Yeah. Okay. Shallows of the Depths. Enchanted Forest Path. Hello, Basil. Path to the Airy. Path to the Airy. Entrance to the Caves. Portal to the Darklands. Oh, these more monsters? Yay. It's, come on. It's hard to pick up cards off this uh, tile table. Okay, we got Merfolk. These kind of remind me of the creatures you see in the game, uh, The Abyss. This is a Kelpie. Amphibic Spider, Shell Snapper, another Shell Snapper, ooh, that's pretty scary looking, Pacific Moon Shark, Hydra, Sea Giant, ooh, I like that, another Sea Giant, Great Kraken, Leviathan, wow. Dryad. Two different pictures for that one. No, there's three of them. Okay. Very nice. Oh, maybe four. Grove Gnome. Canyon Spider. I like that they've got so, such a variety in the monsters here. Shrat. 
Wildcat, Wood Troll, Tree Walker, Wyvern, or oh, Wyvern. I uh, prefer Wyvern. Wyvern sounds a bit too southern to me. Wendigo, Cloudling. Were those different? Yeah, they were. Okay. Lightning Ray. Harpy. Razor Wing. Silent Observer. And a Phoenix. Alright. Uh, so this was just an unboxing and review of the cards, I guess. I don't know entirely too much about the game. Hopefully I can figure out how to do a solo campaign. The next time I do a video is possibly going to be an unboxing of... Uh, Final Girl. But I suppose I need to devote some time to um, figuring out how to battle this storm when it ramps back up. So this was an unboxing of Carnival of Monsters by Richard Garfield.